What are you going to tell her when you go home? I'm just going to say, Mom, I had a whole lot of fun. I just want to thank you for raising me all that money. It's like, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. I know, you're going to go up to your grandma and say, thank you, Grandma. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But on the bright side, you only had to pay half the price. Oh yeah? Yeah, That's so did my mom. I mean, she paid half the price before. I was like, Mom, yeah, yeah. you made this possible for me. Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> but it's been a whole lot of money at camp. Probably one of my my favorite favorite pastimes, my favorite things to do. You get to come out for a week and be away from society and be away from real life, and you get to just be alone in God's creation. Not just to be alone, but be with other fellow Christians in God's creation, and be able to enjoy that and be able to grow spiritually at the time of growth. I guess it's when the kids come up at the end of the week and after they've been talking to me, hey, Big Jeff, how you doing? Or hi, Big Jeff, all week long. And then at the end of the week when mom and dad comes and they all just got to have that big last hug and a cry before they leave because they're going to miss us so much. So we've established that uh, family camp with the kids by the end of the week. And they just, they can't wait to get back here next year. And, and those that have to, to go home on Friday and uh, won't be back for a year, they're, they're touched by the atmosphere here. It's an awesome um, experience, and I think you'd have a lot of fun here if you just tried it. We learned about stories about Jesus and God. Do it. It is. You'll have a great time. I think you'll be singing in the chapel. I love doing that. So far, we've been studying about, like, promises that God made to like Abram about he's gonna have a baby then when they're really old they get one the stuff and we're talking about Moses don't be afraid to lead people uh, Moses going to the promised land he brought what God told him to bring and he didn't know where he was going at first but God led him to the promised land of milk and honey it's almost like we're going to a new place, but we're really changing levels and all kinds of things. Yeah, it's been a long time, so this really just renewed my love for camp. Because after that one summer, I wanted to go back, but never did. But this, this just like me being that camp, because I do a lot of the stuff that the kids do. Mm. Like, church is very important to me. I have to go to church, so I need some clarity. Mm. Like, I put my head in church. I go to a neighborhood, United Methodist, and neighborhood in the morning. I'd say the major difference that I've noticed is I've got a lot more things in common with people here just because I do share my faith freely with, you know, my friends and things. And when I went to nature camps, it was, oh yeah, look, we're outside and it's fun and all, but here it's like we're all building towards something, you know. We all have the, the same common goals and interests. Camp's camp's really important because it... You just need to get away from home once in a while, and um, it's a great experience because it'll teach you to not be so like hanging on your parents, and it really brings you God. I mean, you just feel like He's always with you. Because I personally feel good when I'm around other Christians. They should come to this camp because it's so much fun and everybody like is all together and um. Just learn about God is so fun, and you do a lot of activities. <laughs> you have the most wonderful counselors. <laughs> and I've always dreamed of a, of a program where young people can come to a church camp, spend the summer doing some intentional Christian discipleship, learning to integrate that with a work ethic, a work life, and a service, a servant's heart. Uh, I, I think that's a tremendously valuable tool for the church. 
because that's a time in life when, when young people are making decisions that will guide them for years.